All right, guys, Tony here, and this is the beginning of the tutorials for Livestream Alpha. Uh, what I want to do first is just give you an overview um, so that you can understand exactly what the tool is supposed to be doing and highlight some additional tools that we put in here um, that basically um, they're good marketing tools, not necessarily SEO tools, but tools that we can use uh, to our advantage when we're doing specific jobs online depending on what kind, kind of campaigns that we're working with okay so anybody who's got video send alpha uh, this is going to look very very similar to you and there's no problem with that because what works with video send alpha is going to work even better with live stream alpha because live streaming um, to YouTube to daily motion to Facebook is giving us additional power anyway and with the backlinking strategies that we know work so well with video send alpha I felt it was important that we put these into this tool as well, but that we would build out some other marketing tools um, so that we could do different strategies as well. And that will give us a little bit more diversity. At the same time, we got a lot of power coming from doing live streams and the power of ranking in live streams. Okay. Now, just a word of, of note before we go further. Um, this tool is live streaming to YouTube live events. It's live streaming to um, Facebook live events as well and it's going to be um, is streaming to, to daily motion as well okay now with the, that kind of diversity we can just build up campaigns very very quickly using a combination of those um, platforms if we choose okay I know for a fact that most people are going to stick with the YouTube live events and there's a good reason for that is because it's very good for SEO and for ranking but the point I wanted to make was that Facebook Live can bring a lot of traffic, guys. Don't forget that we do SEO to get traffic, okay? Once we have got traffic, we can, you know, we can become better marketers. We can become more advanced in our marketing by being able to um, work on conversion rates and things like that. I know that doesn't sound sexy for SEO people. I know that, you know, page one rankings for a lot of people, for a lot of SEO people seems to be like the holy grail. But... Traffic is traffic, and if you want to take things to another level with your marketing, then you need traffic to be able to tweak um, your campaigns so that you can convert. And to be able to do that, you need traffic initially, okay? So until we can get to that point, um, we kind of stalled on how well we can make money, how we can improve the conversion rates, how we can improve um, the, and maximize the traffic that we already generate okay so you're going to see a lot of that throughout the tutorials throughout the webinars throughout all that kind of stuff where i'm not walking away from SEO. i'm just trying to open your eyes to other traffic sources okay i just feel it's so important um and that's going by you know looking at the, the kind of comments we've been seeing in facebook groups on skype groups on uh support and you know just over the years in the webinars uh, you know everybody seems to be hung up on page one Okay, page one is fine as long as you know as long as you do you're doing work with that traffic to get that traffic back so that we're not focused on just new traffic but that also that we're converting that traffic so that we can make money as well. Okay, so <clears throat> and the tool itself you can see down here um we've got the tabs on the left hand side and we've got the settings and stuff up here on the right hand side. Now you will see that we've got some YouTube API stuff in here and that's because we've got two brand new tools. One is called Traffic Redirect, one is called URL Finder. The Traffic Redirect is a great tool actually, it's a fantastic tool. And what we can do with this is we can, um, I'm just simply clicking get the API key right now while I'm trying to demonstrate this. It, it will create an API key here. If you're wondering what it's for, don't worry about it too much. It's just something that works with our service so that we can um, create links for, us, for ourselves. Now what we can do with this, um, the traffic redirect uh, link is we can put in here a visible link which is basically a cloaked link okay it's a link it could be something like anthonyhays.me forward slash promotion okay now if I do a backlink campaign for example for uh, a launch jacking uh, product okay say I want to do launch jacking there's a JVZ launch coming up and I want to send a bunch of backlinks there okay after that launch is finished often these launches kind of close okay um, but if there's another launch coming up next week I can simply change the destination URL and this will do a complete 301 redirect for the visible link as we called it in here and that means every single backlink it was coming to that visible link last week 
It's now being redirected with the 301 redirect to your new campaign, giving you a head start. Okay, now that's a money saver as well because if you do a whole bunch of backlinks over time and you just keep redirecting them, then you know you can see that you, you're you going to get a head start on everybody else, okay? That's what that tool is about. The second tool that we've added in, and there's a third one just being built. Um, this one is actually kind of a tribute to um, Video Traffic Genie. Um, I, I looked at that tool and I thought this, the strategy was great, but I, felt, I, you know, I just felt that we could um, bulk um, campaign it, okay, if, for one of a better term. And what this does is it, it will search YouTube with bulk keywords, okay? Bulk keywords that will search YouTube, it will find any broken links within the YouTube descriptions. But more than that, it will tell you in, in, in the very same second if that domain is available. Now, when you see this tool in action, you're gonna see there's a lot of red um, before you start to get some green, okay? That's why this had to be fully automated and that's why I wanted to do it because I thought it was such a great strategy. I just felt that it could be done a little bit more automated and I wanted to put extra tools in here anyway. So. Um, I kind of nicked her idea, but we have done it better and we're going to be um, adding a lot more to it as well. I've been playing around with some different things um, for different platforms, not just YouTube. Um, there's other sites that you can do very, very similar with. And we will be putting in here as well some kind of keyword suggest tool uh, as well, okay? Um, so that we can really maximize this and it's super fast, I mean really fast. Uh, so that's the two new tools that we got at the moment. There's a third one coming that's an Amazon tool. Then there's going to be one more, uh, which is a launch tracking tool. Uh, we will have these in here. Um, probably one of those will be uh, over the next few days. And after that, maybe another week or so before we get the second one in. And um, there's a little bit more work to be done on that second one. So we kind of put that one back until we did the Amazon one first. Okay. So live stream alpha. Um, basically what we can do in here is we can just basically create a project or just create one temporarily. And when we go in here to add um, the video details, what we're doing is we're streaming pre-recorded videos, okay, pre-recorded videos we can stream via um, YouTube live events, via Daily Motion, and via Facebook Live, okay. That's basically the principle of what live stream alpha is about, but we will be adding some nice little strategy tools that are really useful and the kind of stuff I use myself these days. Um, and this is gonna add some additional power and give you a head start over all your com competition, okay. So I'll see you in the next video. We'll carry on, we'll go through the, the settings and then we'll go through um, building out some accounts and all the usual stuff we'll do, you know, step by step and build out a campaign and you can see how I do it. And um, then you'll have a good idea if you watch this from beginning to end and make sure you watch every single video. I will build out an actual campaign and you can see exactly how I use it. Okay, thanks.